Hello and welcome to this tutorial in Czar. Today I'm going to show you how to make a chevron pattern another way um, by making a um, fill out of it. So first turn on the grid and then draw a shape like this. It's one piece and then make it uh, 48 and miter join and square cap. After that's made, need to drag a guide down right to this point here and one on this point. And then I'm going to move this down. Drag this up a little bit here. Okay. Now that that's made, position it as close as possible. So we're going to do a little distortion here. Then drag another guide out right at the end here. And next I'm going to change the line to a shape. And then grab the shape tool and hold the control key down until this snaps to the guide. Also make sure this one snaps just to line them up. And then you can see here that it's not quite the same size all the way through. So what I'm going to do is just drag this down, hold the control key until I get it to snap right here and then go back to the shape tool and drag this one down until it snaps. Then turn off the grid. So now, hopefully, this is all one size. So now, you can delete the uh, guides. And this should all be one uh, continuous piece. Now I'm going to draw a line down the middle, hold the control key, and I'm also going to change the color of this to just uh, like a pink. What I want to do is make sure that the line is lined up with the uh, nodes here. So nice feature in Czar is you can hold the Alt key down and then tap the arrow key left to right to move by one pixel. Get it just right. I found that trying to align this didn't work correctly. It was off center a little bit, but uh, just nudging it a little bit would work. So after that's done, select everything and press Control 4 on the keyboard, and it's going to make two pieces. Now that those two pieces are made, one of these pieces I want to make a lighter color. Or I'm sorry, a darker in this, in this uh, instance. And after that's made, I'm going to select everything and group it together and make a create a bitmap copy and make sure that that is on true color alpha uh, because I want it to be see-through and then click create. So now that that's all made I'll just move these over to the side here and next draw a rectangle and change its fill to be the uh, piece that I just made. So it's going to be a bitmap repeating tile and it's going to be the piece I just made. So just drag this down, hold the control key so now that that's made can draw a background on it just draw out a square Turn on snapping, move it to the back, control B, and then drag it into place. Now, alternatively, you can see the fill is just a little bit off. I'm going to change that. And now that that's all made, now that uh, there's chevron in there and 
Uh, you can change this to any size you want. Group it together. Stretch it out. Make it smaller. So I hope this helps you out. This is just one way of doing it that I was kind of experimenting with. And um, hope you like tutorial. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Take care.